Alright, so hello everybody, so welcome to another video of the legendary experiments. So my last video you have seen all that uh, we told you some interesting facts that you may have not heard anywhere in any kinds of schools and any kinds of places. But all source are taken from internet. Some editings we have done on the editing on the facts page. My friend has also done, I have also done. So please remember that no copyright claim strike should be there on the video because it is totally our plan and also we have made it on our hard work. So like it, share it also. So today in this video, we will do some crazy things. So a lot of days have been passed and I thought that uh, we are not doing any kinds of crazy things. We are only doing that random experiments and random on random experiment topics. And I'm seeing that the videos are getting a little bit longer. They're taking almost 18 or 20 minutes. I thought that it is getting very longer and you may feel bored while seeing the whole video and my channel would not get monetized with this process if I do more longer videos. So I thought today to do some crazy things, which crazy thing which you have not seen, you have seen it in the thumbnail that what I am doing with a bucket of water, I am drinking it. So let's begin that crazy thing. So you have seen this, so for by this thing, it may be acidic and it may be anything also to it may occur anything to me. So for this, you have to like this video, share it, subscribe and comment below how was my video. So. So I would recommend, highly recommend you not to try this at home and also you can't get that chemical at home and not to try this experiment at home and anywhere. You can try this under adult supervision but not alone because you may burn your tongue and any parts of your mouth. So I would highly recommend you not to try this experiment at home. Okay, so without wasting our time, let's get started. show it to you very fast see this it is written here purified water which means it is distilled water and check here this is the price chemical industries name i will open this lid i am trying this but you can try you should not try this experiment at home because it can be hazardous it can be hazardous because distilled water is slightly acidic see this this is purified water which is called distilled water see Okay, so now I will pour it in a glass. Check this. Wait. Let me pour it, then I will show it to you. After we will drink it. Okay, so here I have taken two glasses of water. You can, you will see that these are all normal glasses of water. See this one and this one. So you may think that I am making you a fool by telling that we will do some crazy experiment. But this is not the right one. See the difference. Bringing it near, you can see the difference between the two glasses. You can see there are a lot of differences. In this glass of water, I have taken normal daily life water that we drink, normal mineral water. See here, there are bubbles on the edges of the surface of this, this water. But in this purified drinking, distilled, sorry, it's not drinking, it's only distilled water, purified distilled water, you can see no bubbles are there and the water is absolutely clear than this one this is a little bit messy one you can see the edges have grayish grayish things on the edges of the glass but here is totally plain water so now you will know that what we are going to do i will drink this water yes and that is the crazy thing usually you know that distilled water has no minerals and it is slightly acidic also we are going to drink it and we are going to test this water that how we it will feel when we drink it whether it will go wrong or it will taste like the normal daily water okay so first i will drink this normal water then i will drink this distilled water so now let's begin so first of all to do this crazy experiment yeah, i have taken normal our daily life water means that water which we drink in our Normal bottled water, we have seen it. Let's drink it. This is the normal water that I told you. So it has lots of minerals in it and no wastage of minerals is there. So at the beginning of the video you have seen that how distilled water is collected in a small beaker. So now I will tell what is a distilled water. <coughs> at first, distilled water is a water, uh, it is a normal water. At first, I will tell you the process. Okay, at first we take small tap water amount and then we pour it in a big beaker. After pouring it in a big beaker, there is a large pop cork attached at the top of the beaker. And 
after that and after that uh, at the end of the flat bottom beaker uh, heater or burner is placed and the water keeps goes on burning and the water burns and water evaporates and that water gets collected on the edges on the top surface of the beaker on the flat bottom flask the top surface of the beaker and after that there is a small condensing tube in which there is a small tube flat tube through which the vapors get collected and after that in the big that fat condensing tube at the end of this at the the bottom end of the condensing tube is a, there is a small hole from there lots of forced water and lots of water is forced into that tube and when the tube fills means cold water is thrown and it is poured into the condensing tube and after it gets filled up at the out, upper outlet the water goes up and the water vapor that got collected in the flat tube gets, gets now condensed gets condensed and again it turns into liquid yes water vapor turns into water liquid then it is collected in a small beaker this is how it is this distilled water is collected i know it is a very difficult process but i have used my all knowledge and powers to explain you now you can search in the internet also that how distilled water is formed and how it is collected i if i have made anything wrong then you can comment it below and tell me i will correct also myself that what wrong i have made so this is how distilled water is collected, collected and distilled water is slightly acidic because it is pure it is fully pure and it has a acidic ph of 5.8 because it absorbs carbon dioxide from atmosphere and makes it slightly acidic normally these waters have ph of 7 but distilled water distilled water is 5.8 Okay, so I will first keep it in my mouth. It can burn, slightly burn my mouth, means my tongue. Let's see what happens. Let's drink it. And that is the reason I am telling you not to try this experiment at home. At first you can see this, it is clear and smells are coming because it has no minerals in it. tested it and it is not that acidic one it is usually used in cars battery and other kinds of batteries means, means batteries charging elements that is used very carefully so basically it has no minerals in it. it has zero minerals it has zero minerals and so it is called distilled water and you can see here i have throwed out the mouth water and you can see it is not impure because I think it has collected minerals from my mouth collected minerals from my tongue and so the upper layer of the tongue the flesh I think it will disappear after one day and I think again come back after two days so I think this will happen so let's drink it again so it is generally used in cars battery and lead acid batteries I am drinking it so this is the crazy experiment and also while drinking it if I drink it After drinking this water, it feels more sweet. This water is more sweet because it has minerals and calcium, magnesium in it. But it is very bitter taste. It is a very bitter and raw taste in it. And it is not very generally used for drinking water. We should not drink distilled water because it may dehydrate your body and it may you may feel to eat drink lots of water after this. So let's see. If the distilled water up to one minute in my mouth as I am throwing it, you can see minerals. I think it is collecting minerals from my mouth, it's collecting into this beaker. Now, let's swallow it. You should not drink it more, I will take more two sips. Okay, I think that is it. I will not recommend you also to drink this water because it may. Damage anything, it may damage your tongue. So I will take one more. And that's it. And one more. That is it for this day. You should not eat. See this, it has collected minerals. See, this is now not as similar as the normal bottled one, but it is it has collected minerals from my mouth. 
I would not recommend you to do this experiment at home. Also, you can't get distilled water in your home. You can get it in laboratory processes only. So I thought this was a crazy experiment. Usually we drink bottled water, but suddenly it came to my mind that let's drink mm, distilled water. So I think I think you can drink one glass of water per day. <coughs> Sorry, and you should not drink distilled water because it may dehydrate your body and you may have to drink lots of water after this thing. So I have did this experiment, it was a crazy thing after a lot of days. So now it was a good lot. If you have understand anything from this video and if you have liked this video and if you have learned anything from this video after my distilled water explanation, so please like this video, share it with your friends and relatives more. And I am seeing that lots of people are watching my video but they are not subscribing. What is the reason? Subscribe to my channel. And please show me some support. Almost 160 people have subscribed. I need 200 subscribers to do it. Lots of people are watching and not subscribing. Do it, please. But I am working. This was a crazy experiment. It can, it can go wrong if you, this was acid and not distilled water. So please, subscribe and share it with your friends more. I did this crazy experiment for you people only. I will fill it in my mouth after drinking. Because it can damage my these tongue buds on the upper surface so you should drink one sip of water up and throw the distal that water surface on your tongue so that it, your tongue may not get damaged so i have told more things in this video if you have learned anything from this video and if you have learned the process please like share comment and so this was the video of this week so next week i will try to bring an unboxing video of a really cool thing really a cool experiment means science thing so stay tuned for this one so if you have liked if you have liked also then you subscribe and if you have not liked then also you subscribe so check my channel click here for more updates this is one video this is one video this is also one video also see subscribe here or you can subscribe here also if i have given here okay so this was for today so till then take care bye